is a food bank where we actually oh. came and we served and we lost Tyler. Wow. I bit it. it wow. People want their produce to look perfect. Well, this is all the produce that doesn't look perfect. Yep. But the farmers are going to do what to it? I mean, they're going to chunk it. It almost costs them money to get rid of it. They can bring it here. What they'll do is they'll repurpose it and give it yes. to people that need it. Sick, homeless, um, elderly, like yep. children. And they don't care if it looks a little bit less they than don't care. It tastes They good. are a little bit more than hungry. So let's roll that beautiful footage of carrots. That beautiful carrot footage. It. I got my friend here, Dave, from City Sur. But also, I want to thank all of you at New Life Church for the opportunity you've given many of your pastors, many of our people there, opportunity to serve right here in the land of Israel. Well, you know, a third of Israel live under the poverty line. And so behind us, we're collecting produce that would have be wasted. This would have been destroyed by the packing houses. They've given it to us. And this is all we're going to go out within the next 48 hours to the needy. 200 non-profit organizations throughout Israel, battered women's shelters, homeless shelters, after-school programs for, for kids at risk, centers for the elderly, anything you can imagine, any needy population is going to benefit from this. We want to give healthy food to the needy. We're part of CityServe International. Part of your missions giving goes to helping the poor in Israel. In Genesis 12, the Bible clearly says that God will bless those who blesses Israel. What CityServe believes is the need to be aspirational in our helping and our giving. That is, we have the phrase, from your neighborhood to the nations. We find people that are in need and we help them. We need your support of Israel. We need your support of the, the needy. And we also want you in your own communities. If we can come over here and do this, what are we missing that we can do in our own community every day? Maybe it's not cleaning dirt off carrots. Maybe it's helping your neighbor. Maybe it's helping a single mom. The Bible says in Leviticus chapter 23, verse 22, that we all have a field. And that field that represents our time, our talent, our resources. If we are faithful with our tithe and also leaving the corners to help the poor, that God will multiply it. He will expand our field, our capacity to give and to serve. That's why I like to say, if God can get it through you, He'll give it to you. Thank you for your generosity. We've been inspired while we've been here to see how we can help others and uh, we want to certainly challenge you guys to do the same. Because of all that you do, we're able to do the things that you're seeing here today. And so again, thank all of you who help nice. serve and also who help work with City Serve. Really it's because of your missions giving that we're able to be here and experience this. Thank you for your giving. It's touching the whole world. This is Brooke and Marcus and we are right outside Jerusalem today in Israel. It's Marcus and Brooke, but anyways. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still chewing dirt. Eat dirt. 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 I did. Mm. Fun fact, Tyler and I, uh, we met at the Dirt Conference. Roll that footage. Dirt Conference. Oh, you have Keep it? Keep snapping. You have it? What are we rolling?